Hey everybody, Brandon here from CAD Intentions, and in today's Two Minute Tuesday, I'm going to show you guys how to fix a missing plot style or CTB file within AutoCAD, like this one here. I'm also going to show you, using the same method, how to add a new CTB or new set of CTBs to your drawings so you can use them when plotting. Let's jump right in. <laughs> All right, so as I mentioned, we're gonna be looking at how to fix this missing CTB error here. You'll get this typically when you receive a drawing from a client uh, or an old drawing that may have been using an old CTB. First, you're gonna to need to track down that old CTB. If you don't have it, your main options are going to be requesting it from whoever sent it to you. Sometimes say an architect or a, another consultant will send you a set of drawings and forget to e-transmit or package up all of their files. That will mean you're missing the plot style or a CTB file. And without it, you're not gonna be able to necessarily get rid of this missing uh, error here. Uh, you could use one of the default CTBs that AutoCAD comes with, with ACAD.CTB being the complete default or basic one. And you can see previewing, it's going to print out probably okay, but you're going to lose out on any specific line weights, colors, styles that the client or consultant has used for their drawing. So the first step is to track down your CTB file. The next step is once you have it, you need to path or add that file to your AutoCAD default. So by typing in options and hitting enter, you're gonna to wanna to go to the files tab here and go down to the printer support file path plus sign. Hitting it is gonna show you the different paths that you can add. And in our case, we're looking to add a plot style table search path. This is where AutoCAD is going to look for your CTB files. One way to do this would be to simply save all of your CTBs either in the default path here or in say a CAD templates and standards folder somewhere on your server or on your hard drive. From here, you simply need to add a new path and browse by hitting browse up here or paste in the path where you have saved your CTB. In our case, my missing CTB is this AIA standard one. I talk about this a lot in my fundamentals and workflows AutoCAD course, which I'll link up above as well as down below. If you wanna go into detail of setting up a template and setting up and using a CTB, uh, this is a great way to kind of jumpstart that in your drafting career. But back to this, we're going to copy the path where this is saved and add it by clicking the add down here, pasting it and hitting enter. Now you can see that this path here has been added to my files options and hitting OK is going to fix your missing CTB path, assuming that the missing CTB is now in that folder. All you need to do is add that path to where the CTB is. So now when you go to plot, I'm going to type in plot here and hit enter you'll see that my missing CTB has now been fixed and is now located. This is because AutoCAD knows where to look for it and has found it. Uh, sometimes you'll need to save or hit type in regen to make sure that this is updated, but assuming your path is correct and that's where it's saved, this is going to automatically fix that missing path. Now, using this same process here, I'm just gonna start a new drawing using a template. Uh, we're just gonna use Let's use this one here. All right, so we've got a blank drawing and a blank layout here. We're gonna just type in plot, and you can see that we don't have a plot style set up. But what if I want to add a new plot style to this drawing? Maybe I've received some. Maybe I just have a uh, an old CTB or a default CTB I would like to start using in my drawings, but it's not showing up on this list you're going to have to simply go to your options again. And this is the same process. You just need to add it to your list. Now, again, I recommend having a single plot styles folder, either on your server or somewhere on your hard drive where you continually can add your CTBs and they're going to automatically be found and populated in that list because they're all in the same folder where AutoCAD is already looking. But say, 
for example, you want to path to a specific folder, maybe for a project specific plot style, you can use the same method here. So going down to the printer support file path dropdown, hitting the plus sign, and then adding the plus sign again for plot style table search path, clicking add, you're going to create a new one. And I'm going to just pull this window over here. You can see on my C drive CAD projects, I've got a plot styles example, and I want to add this plot style example. So I'm going to copy that path again, we're going to go back. And again, simply hitting add is going to create a new path for AutoCAD to search for plot styles, I can hit paste and hit enter. Now you can also add a lot of other search paths. So if you want to explore these options here, again, check out my course, but you can also just kind of play around with these and find other file types that you may need to search for. But we've added this one now, I'm going to hit OK, you can also hit apply and then OK. And now by hitting plot, it's going to bring up our plot window. And now when we hit this drop down, you're going to see example plot style is showing up now. We can now use this in any drawing within AutoCAD since our profile within AutoCAD now has that path added to it. So as long as the plot style stays in that folder, it's going to show up as an option here. So I hope that answered your question. Uh, again, you're going to need to get that CTB if it is missing, but this is how you can add it and fix that error within AutoCAD. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit subscribe down below here as well as like the video and have a good one. Cheers. Thanks for watching the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, be sure to check out my last video right here uh, and don't forget to subscribe up here to make sure you're up to date and you see all my new videos. Thanks again. Cheers.